Let me just begin by being very direct about this, okay? There's no link between vaccines and autism. Very clear. And then this is not just my opinion or my judgment. I really try to be so careful not to, not to post anything or say anything during any interviews that aren't totally accurate because, I mean, I'm, I'm fighting against misinformation, so it's just imperative that I be accurate myself. And it was interesting to see how controversial that was because it's unequivocal that vaccines do not cause autism. It's unequivocal. Yeah, there's there's no link between MMR vaccines and autism. MMR is measles, mumps, rubella. And the 1998 Wakefield paper that started this whole thing wasn't just wrong, it was totally fraudulent. So Andrew Wakefield, he was a gastroenterologist, he, he lost his medical license for ethical violations and for data manipulation. But so this the study involved only 12 children. It used completely unethical procedures and the, and the journal that published it, The Lancet, tracked it in 2010. And the reason why I think this is so important is because it still influences parents 25 years later. I mean, we're dealing with the worst measles outbreak in 33 years, and it stems from this. You know, this paper in 1998 that was totally fraudulent. 